Hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel. You might see my glasses fogging up during this video because it is really warm and even though the air conditioning is on, it's going to be about 90 degrees Fahrenheit here in Bethel, Ohio today. It is August 3rd, 2022. So in Celsius, I think that's about 36 or so. So it's, it's a little toasty. And, and yet, since he, we, we are now in the fall catalog, so I'm trying to get my mind around that because it's so very hot, and yet here we are moving forward with the seasons as far as, as Sensi goes. So I thought I would take a few minutes and share with you some of the um, non-pumpkin items that are coming down the pike. We have some new scents in the cleaning products, the laundry products, and the body care. And I, I bought these kits, um, the consultant kits that were available, and I must say, I'm quite pleased, and there are two of these scents that I really didn't like in the wax, and yet I'm enjoying them in the new products. So I'm going to go ahead and share those with you. So first of all, this is the one I did like in the wax, and that was Vanilla Mint. So Vanilla Mint is now available in the cleaning products. So we have the bathroom cleaner, the dish soap, and the counter clean. So those are all in Vanilla Mint. Vanilla Mint is wintergreen frost citrus, uh, frozen citrus, and vanilla. So, and don't let that wintergreen worry you. It, to me, it reads more of a mixed mint or a peppermint, and it's blended really nicely with that frozen citrus, so it's more like just a cool citrus mint blend, and it really works for cleaning products. Uh, I've already used about half of this counter clean, and it just smells wonderful. It's very refreshing in the kitchen, and it's it's beautiful when it's so hot outside to have something that's kind of a light minty citrus to wake up your senses. It's just beautiful. I like the counter clean very much. It leaves us a protective coating so the dirt the next time doesn't stick. And I was always worried about that. I thought, oh, is it leaving a coating? It just feels completely clean. So don't let that worry you. It, it's, it's just a wonderful product and it really does work. It gets stubborn stains clean. I love the counter clean. Then we have the bathroom cleaner. I also like this. I have used many different scents and I haven't opened this one yet, but now that I know what the counter clean smells like, I know what to expect. And again, I think that cool minty citrus blend is gonna be beautiful in the bathroom. Also the dish soap. Now, I, to be quite honest, prefer other brands of dish soap. I often will use this just for a quick, you know, if I have to clean a glass real quickly, I don't need a heavy duty. To me, this is not all that heavy duty, but it's good for light cleaning in between. If you have a dishwasher, which I don't, in between the dishwasher loads, this is really nice to just do some ketchup. So that's the dish soap, but the vanilla mint in the cleaning, top notch. Now the other two new ones, and I'm gonna save the most, the powerhouse for last. Okay, so first I'm gonna share with you the body care, and this is in Vanilla Waves. And Vanilla Waves was a big hit in wax last year. Now, I was not a big fan because it is body care-esque, and I didn't really care for it in the wax, but in the body care, I'm really enjoying it. So this is coming in the body wash, the or the shower gel, the, the hand soap in the new bottle, and look how nice and big this is and it's easier to get the liquid out. You don't need much. A little bit of this just goes a long way in your hands. So if you're used to a big frothy amount needed in other soaps, this is just, it's just a little bit and you have quite a bit for your hand washing. This is the hand cream and I'm loving this. It's really nice before I go to bed. And then the soak. So if you want your own little luxury spa at home, these Scentsy soaks are just wonderful. Use about a cup in your bath water and take me away. It's just absolutely wonderful. So Vanilla Waves, let me look this up, sea salt, whipped vanilla, and sticky caramel. Now the caramel is not so sticky in these body products. It's really nicely blended with the vanilla and the sea salt. And those of you who don't care for salty scents, Natalie, don't let that worry you. It's very subtle. So this is more of a, oh, it's beautiful. It's like a perfumey vanilla, light caramel and a, just a touch of a sea breeze. Really beautiful in the body products. Who knew? Who knew? I'm enjoying that. And again, I was not a real big fan in the wax. Don't come for me. I know a lot of people love that in the wax. Now, brace yourself. So I don't know about the rest of you, but I have struggled with some of the laundry products being scented enough 
that I couldn't smell them on the clothing afterwards. Well, have no fear. So we have fluffy fleece now. We have this in the laundry liquid, in the washer whiffs, and in the dryer discs. These guys, you just throw them in the dryer. The washer whiffs are a powdery, crystallized kind of product. I don't know how well you can see that. Okay, and these you just pop right in the laundry load with your soap. So you just use several. I just dumped some in there. I usually use three or four scoops. Um, powerhouse. I haven't even opened the lick laundry liquid yet. All I used yesterday was the washer whiffs. It'll knock you over. It is so strong and just beautiful. This is a very fresh, clean laundry-esque product. So the notes in um, Fluffy Fleece is black currant, which is just giving a bit of sweetness. I wouldn't say you would know that was black currant if you hadn't read that. Cozy Musk, yes. So it has a muskiness, a perfumious, and heliotrope, which is a floral. So when this was in the wax, I, again, this was in last year's holiday bricks, I believe, and it, I thought it was just a very strong kind of floral, fresh laundry scent. So for scenting the house, I wasn't a big fan of the wax. And again, don't come for me. I know a lot of people love this. This is meant for the laundry products. So let me tell you, I do my laundry in a laundromat. I used to be an EMT with a fire department, and I guess I saw too many, too many house fires started from dryers, too many leaking uh, washers, and I, it, plus we have a smaller septic system. We live in the country. I didn't want to overload it with laundry water. Also, I prefer to go and do all the laundry at once and have it done. So for those reasons, I use the local laundromat, which is pristine. They take their, they pride themselves on cleanliness and on all the machines working. And it's huge. They've recently remodeled. It's as big as a football field. It's just absolutely enormous laundromat. Spotlessly clean. So I had one washer, a, a, a quadruple load, and I put in about four scoops of this. And there were other people doing their laundry. All I could smell in that room, I went out to the car to put away the the liquids and the washer whips. When I came back in, all I could smell in that enormous laundromat was fluffy fleece. It is that strong. So start out with just a little. I can smell it on all the clothing this morning when I got up. The closets absolutely smell of fluffy fleece. The towels, the bathroom, very, very strong. And it's beautiful. It is lovely in the laundry. It was just born to be a laundry product. That is the best scent. So I can't rave enough. It's really nice. Yes, so we are in the fall catalog. And just let me make a couple of other comments. If it's too soon for you to start doing all the pumpkin and everything, you know, I'm not real eager to start melting pumpkin. Please remember we have this island collection. And the labels are beautiful. They look like this. So this is my favorite from the island collection. This is um, tiare and coconut. And very much about the beautiful sweet tiare flower. It smells like a Hawaiian lei when you're in Hawaii and you've done something, uh, some sort of accomplishment and people are loading up your neck with flower lei. Now I graduated from my undergraduate degree and, and you just are covered with flower lei and it smells like this. So yeah, it's just beautiful. Oh, even my husband who does not like floral. This is such a sweet, beautiful floral on the coconut way in the background. So check out the Island Collection. My other favorite is Salted Bergamot Breeze. And there are three, there are five all together. And I believe the, the, the bundle is $25. So yeah, it's still so sweltering outside. Jump on this Island Collection. I think you'll really enjoy it. Now, if you are ready for fall scents, I just wanted to mention some of my returning favorites because, you know, the catalog has just turned over. So if you look at our websites, and I'll link mine down below, but whoever your consultant is, go on their website. You will see these beautiful returning fragrances. So we have Toasted Acorn and Oak. That is such a beautiful, comforting frag fragrance. Harvest Blessings. This one is um, Pumpkin, Apple, and Oak. Then we have Bright Cider Life, which is red apple, cider, and pumpkin. This is a beautiful fragrance. Fan favorite last year. And we have Cedar Cider, which is one of my all-time favorite Scentsy fragrances. You have the blend of the apple and like just like a cedar closet. It is so gorgeous. And a returning bakery favorite, 
graham cracker crunch. If you haven't smelled those, so it's a mix of graham cracker and peanut butter, and it it's it's as if you had just taken the butter and the graham cracker crumbs and lined a pie tin, and you were ready to put that in the oven. It just smells so gorgeous. There is a nuttiness, I suppose, a creaminess from the peanut butter, but to me this reads very much graham more than it does peanut. So that's graham cracker crunch. So if you're wanting to ease into the fall fragrances, those are some of my favorites. So welcome to fall. Uh, try out some of these new cleaning body and laundry scents because we haven't had these uh, scents in those formats before. I think you'll really be pleased. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Hug your loved ones. Bye for now.